everybody. Today I'm going to share with you how to line your cake tin. Really important you line your cake tin perfectly to achieve a perfect result when you take your cake out of the oven. Okay, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my paper and you see I've got a rectangle of paper here. I'm going to fold it in half, like so. And then I'm going to fold it in half again. Okay. What you need to do is keep, keep your finger on your closed corner and take your long side over to your short side, like that. And continue to do that, taking your long side to your short side, keeping your closed corner as your point all the time. And that way you'll have a perfect circle. A little bit like making paper aeroplanes. So push that paper down really, really firmly so you've got a nice crease. Bring your tart tin over, your cake tin over. Measure your, from the inside, the center point to the outside of your tin, okay? And then, very, very important, take your scissors, have your scissors handy, and cut with your scissors. Never, never tear your paper, because if you do that, you won't have a perfect edge, and which, won't fit, which will fit perfectly, in your cake tin and what will happen is the ingredients will stick to the edge of the tin where it's not a perfect cut. Okay, open up your paper and you should have a perfect circle which fits perfectly inside your cake tin. What I'm going to do is take that out for a second, give my tin a light spray, a light spray of grease so that my paper sticks, pop my paper in there, I'm going to have my side pieces cut, pop those in there as well, and the other one, and voila, your cake tin is ready to be filled. Okay, I'm going to quickly show you how we, fill, how we um, line a tart tin, ready for your individual tart tans. Exactly the same process, smaller piece of paper, fold it in half, in half again, keep your point, and carry on folding, just in the way that I showed you a moment ago. from the center outwards to the, to the edge. But this time you need to add about a centimeter onto where your thumb is holding or where the edge is, because you need that paper this time to overlap so that it catches your caramel. There we are. Pop it into your tart tin and pop another one on the top. Push it down, push it down well and it's ready to fill. Voila. Hope you enjoyed that and please keep it baking.